Hello there. I'm George Putnam. I'd like to begin with a fact, a simple yet shocking fact. It is this. Pornography and sex deviation have always been with mankind. It's thrilling. It provides kicks to be a homosexual, a sadist. Why this sudden concern? The circulation of this material is the price we pay for freedom in this country. Publishers of this material are on our side. An invitation even is extended to the reader to come join the fun. But the United States Supreme Court does not agree. The United States Supreme Court has described it as dirt for dirt's sake. We describe it as the natural curiosity of youth. But what can you as an individual in your own community do? First, would you display this material on your living room table? These highly colorful magazines picture stark nudity on slick paper. Note the sensual expression alluded to by Dr. Sorokin, the renowned Harvard sociologist, as being the hallmark of so much of contemporary photography. Second, would you read stories from these publications to your family or friends? The more readily to dwell on them over and over and over again. Third, would you undertake to sell this material from door to door? Grocery stores, newsstands, malt shops, everywhere from the corner drugstore to the barber shop. But now consider another fact. 75 to 90 percent of it ends up within your fraternal, civic, or religious organization. That's two billion dollars. It is big business, profitable business, and you and I have a constitutional guarantee to police protection. This is true. The question is this. What are we alive for except to grab all the kicks we can? Come join the fun. What you have just seen required editing to make it sensational. 